right, all right, all right. We're back. It is Burrito Bandito Burrito Review Time, and this is it. The second installment of the great Burrito Redemption Tour uh, to basically swoop in and save. <laughs> no, we're not saving anybody. But we're just going to do some reviews of uh, the spots that Fox 12 tried to do reviews at, um, and we're going to do them the right way. So here you go. We are at Nacho's House, Mexican Kitchen. It is 14, or here, I'll put it right up there, 1447 Northeast Sandy Boulevard in Portland. And there's the back side of that car. So we're right here. We're, we're in the heart of it. And, um, you know, I'll say it. We're, it's a seedy little part of town, but that's good. Sometimes that's the best place. Sometimes it's the best place to find the food. So here we go. First off, eleven dollars. Eleven dollars, not too bad. I'm down with it. I'm. Uh, they got me. I'm, we're all on the same page right now. So well, that's good. Ooh, first off, ooh, all right, all right. Feels pretty good. We got the Bandito filming. All right, Bandito and Bandito is helping with some lights. Both of you guys come in here. Get close to see if you can get that number on that scale. We got 1.46. Not bad. Almost almost a pound and a half. So, so far, things are looking pretty good. And so far, you already have more information about this place than you did when that guy did, tried to do the review on it. So, and I, one thing that guy didn't have, definitely didn't have, was K-Bar. So, we're going to see what we see here. All right, get in here, ladies and gentlemen. All right, all right. There's meat, beans, rice, pico de gallo, not pico de gillo. <laughs> 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 um, Bandito, which side do you want? You want left or right? Left. That, that left? All right. I will take the right then, sir. Come in here a little closer so we can get a good picture here. Uh, tortilla feels a little plasticky, but we'll see once it hits the mouth. You never know. You never know what's going to happen. So I'm going to come in hot, let her wobble for, for Portland and uh, see what we find. I was right about the tortilla. Tortilla is not the best. Um, and it definitely has a little more rice and beans than I'd like. The, um, I mean, it looks like it has everything, but the flavor is just not there. I'm not sure what it is, but uh, the flavor is just. Like, yeah, like, I don't know how else to say it, but it looks good. But then when you bite it, there's not that oomph. There's not that that love that's usually in it. So I'm going to have to go. Six point four on the burrito bandito Richter scale. Um, you know, this is why we do what we do. We had to find out, you know, been Mr. Fox 12 trying to trying to do this and uh, it just wasn't working out. So there you have it, 6.4, second burrito on the great burrito redemption tour. Uh, first one was in St. John's. Uh, we're gonna keep this up. Um, thank you to everybody who's been following us this last year. Um, that was our second year on the interwebs. Um, <laughs> my daughter's making faces at me and going, kidding me what's he saying um but we're in our third year here so send this to fox 12 show them how it's really supposed to be done here's all the info again 11 dollars, almost a pound and a half and sadly it's about 
mediocre, 6.4. But you know what? We're going to come out and try them, you know? Uh, they might have something else here that you really dig, but let's keep supporting our small businesses. Let's um, get into Portland here. And uh, coming up in the next few weeks, we're going to see what else we find. And remember, I am the Burrito Bandito, and you're not. And that's our review. 100% grandma approved.